Welcome back, everyone. You might recognize this area. It is the, uh... Uh... Gar Garahan HQ place thing? That one! Anyway... Um... So... Since we finished the excavator suit, we got a, uh... A new... Quest for it to basically sign it in and whatnot. So I figured we would go ahead and do that. So we're in our pa excavator suit here, looking snazzy as fuck. If not a little, you know, pudgy around the middle there. But that's fine. So there wasn't a, uh... Uh... An assault tron in here. There was just a, a mole man who was glowing, which I figured... Killing people here was no big thing, so I just skipped that. Anyway, register. Is that all, or we got anything else next to do? Stim packs, shotgun shells, power armor still. Oh, yeah, boy! There we go. All right, that was uh, that was all. Hello. That's all? Okay. I was expecting something a little more, but... Whatever works. I mean, power armor stations is a big deal. What, what, what's this? Locate hallucinogen. Ooh, I can get hallucinogen gas here? Excuse me? I mean, if I can get it here, why not? I already got a stealth boy. Oh, that's a... Speaking of, hold on. Not at all what I meant to do. Fuck me. Oh, that's seven. Where's... Oh, right. It's on two. Level action revolver! Level action, uh... Rifle. Right. Yeah. This gun's actually pretty great, so let's go ahead and use it. We got where I set it to. There's good chunks of damage. It's also a good long-range weapon as well, so... Take some time to reload is all. Wow, they really want to be up in my face about this, huh? Fine, fine. You want to be up this close, huh? Huh, dicks? How about that, huh? How about that? The fuck out of missile launcher. God damn. Cool, another abandoned mineshaft key. Or not just fucking special. I'm assuming it's gonna be back here. Oh, it's in here. Cool. Excellent. Oh fuck, I hadn't reloaded this. That sucks. Hey, bud. Beat him in the face! Go! Okay. Also, my chest piece broke and I can't fix it because I need fucking ballistic material. Like that about a bitch, huh? Yeah, I figured we would just do that, get that out of the way, and then uh, we can continue on, so. See how that goes. Also, um, I got that sword thing equipped with that thingy. It still only does 14 damage, so it really sucks. Uh -huh. 
kill a mole man with it on the way down there. So that's why it says uh, over on the right side there. Kill different types of creatures with giant saber. Um, or Grant's saber, I guess it is. Um, it's because I killed a mole man. So, that's all that is. Alright, anyway, back to uh, White Spring. So, that, uh, old-looking Gatling gun, it literally fired like an old-timey Gatling gun, and I did not have enough 5.5, five, or 5mm five to make it worth it. So what I decided to do was just, uh, toss it on the ground, since, since I couldn't, um, you know, use it. Scorch Beast, I'm gonna need you to just fuck off a little bit. I don't want to fight you right now. Come here, Radroach, I need to kill you, you piece of shit. Come here. Come here, you fucker. Okay. Oh, ghouls. Hey, ghouls. How you doing? Okay, yep, this sword is not for me right now. Hold that thought, withered boy. Oh, fuck me. Oh no, I can't move! Ouch. Hey, I'll kill you now. There we go. Oh, fuck me. Fuck. We, uh, good? I know there's one more around here. Oh, fuck, you found me. There's more! There's more than one! Oh, crap. Holy crap, y'all. Fucking shotgun's about to break. Oh, come on! Really, dude? Motherfucker! Fuck it, loot everything, let's go. Everything must go. Everything must be looted. Okay, well, that, uh, was a fucking thing and a half. It's not telling me I have this completed for the fucking ghouls, so I'm gonna try it again here. I killed bugs and mole people. There. Get out of my way. Damn it. Wait, am I wearing power armor? Does he not hurt me when he does that stupid 
acidic shit. Where's he at? There he is. That still hurts, though. God damn it. Yeah, this is not going to work. I need to find some robots to help. I'm level fucking 52. I feel like I'm level 91, guy. And they're all just gonna be like, nope. Scorch beasts are fucking too tough to fucking kill and shit. Let's see the other bunker over here. If it lands, I'll go in to fuck it up, but it just it keeps doing that fucking bullshit. So I need someone to ground it. I got rid of this power armor, or else I'd be, like, taking a lot of hits right now. Okay, let's jump up here. Jump up here. Oh, never mind, I guess. Oh, sweet robots. Hey, guys! Hey! Help the brother out! The thing's attacking your property. Do any of you want to help out with this? What if I stand next to you? Will you start attacking it? If it hits you? Where'd it go? There's a scraggly son of a bitch. Does that not count as attacking it? Come on. Look, I'm gonna get it to attack these robots so that they help me out. At least the Assault Tron, if not both the Mr. Gutsies. But like... Wait, are there two other players converging towards this, or is that guy running away and that guy moving away? If there's two other people there, I will help, but until then, I'm gonna stay right next to these damn robots. Where'd the bastard go? Did he decide, nah, I don't wanna fuck the robots? They would fuck me up. Come on, robots, he's attacking your shit. What are you doing about it? I feel like the Scorch Bar, that beast's uh, hitbox is a little weird. Because so I should definitely have hit him some of those times there when he was like flying right over me. Seems like I did not do that. I think that guy is engaging him, so let's go help him out. End up, wa end up wasting all our, our bullets and ammunition and durability and shit for this gun, but... He's running now. There you are, you bastard. Ah, 
Ah, fuck you! Not right now. Oh fuck, he's got a house here? Oh right, I can't use that because it's broken. Oh fuck, I'm almost dead. Damn it. Oh, thank God. I'm finally fucking dead. Gatling Plasma, there we go, that's what I wanted. How did he get to land that one time? Damn you, bastard. I just drugged up. Let's go. Come on, fight me. Go, you piece of shit! Come on! They gotta make a shit ton of ammo for this gun, huh? Hey, we killed it! Get fucked, Scorch Beast, you son of a bitch. Are Scorch Beast bones, like, really heavy? Way too. They have ultra sight on them, which is neat. Cool. Well, that's done. Let's see the fucking turrets. Because he uh, accidentally shot me that one time. But I didn't fire back, so I don't know why they're attacking me. But whatever. They only do minimal damage to me anyway. Okay, well, all that's done now. Left, cryo grenades left. I have one left.
I'm gonna catch him in a group without hitting that guy. It's a little bit hard. Here we go. That'll work. He's running for it. Well. Oh, hey, he's still alive. Now he's dead. It's time to pick over the loot. Oh. Where did all those ghouls come from? Oh, hey buddy, stop that. I should correct that. Where did all those high-level ghouls come from? Ghouls by themselves, whatever, but that many high-level ones? That's a little weird. I'm about to run out of fusion core power. We need to go to infinity and fuck and beyond. I said, God damn it, to infinity and beyond. There we go. God damn. Okay. So I'm completely lost now. That uh, scorched beast and those ghouls. Took a lot more time than I thought they were going to take. I have no idea where these fucking unruly fucking golf ghouls are at. So you know what? No, 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 don't don't fast travel, damn it. Stop tracking that fucking quest. I have no idea where the fuck they're at. I'll kill them if I find them. But if I can't find them, then fuck it, okay? Anyway, I'm just gonna make my way over to the firehouse here to use it to scrap. That way I'll have some... Why is that a level 50 glowing wolf there? Let's go then! Let's go then, bitch! Come on! Damn it. Fucking red scorpions! Come here, wolf, I want to kill you with the sword. There. That should count as a kill towards it, right? Yeah, there we go, that dinged, okay. Killing the scorpion with it doesn't matter, because the scorpion's a bug. You hear that, you fucking bug? Hmm. This might actually do some decent damage to it. Where you at, you piece of shit? Is it getting its ass kicked by the robots? I 
I didn't mean to kill it, damn it. It's Christ, man. That doesn't do any damage. Never mind. I'm out. Beautiful motherfucker right there. Um, woo! Just for a thing down the road. Excellent. Okay, I think that should give me enough, right? Yeah. What was this? Ghoul Slayer's Cultist Blade. Damage to ghouls. Oh, 50? Fuck, I can't do anything with that. That's fine. Um, I have a disease cure. Thank you. I recovered from weeping sores. We got for food. Nothing else. Okay. No. Good to know that the scorpion can't get in here. Because this is my life now. This is a trap. What does this trap do? Gun somewhere or something? What the fuck's going on here? Is this why the everything's so high level? Is that 70 fucking six guys over there? Hmm. Well, let's level up over here, I guess. I think I need one more level for it, right? Yeah, one more level for a uh, pick one. Okay. Um, you mean hit escape again. Last one of ghoulish. Let's go. There we go. All right. And what do we got for actual weapons here that we can use? Um, the giant, a uh, Grant Slayer is not going to be helpful against this at all. Um, I have my grenade launcher, which has 16 shots left for it. Not bad. Um, I got my minor gauntlet, but that is not as much as that. The fuck is that? Someone is just going ballistic around here. Fuck. One just die for a second. There we go. Good, good acid. Yeah, boy. Just the bathroom. It's a common area. Let's go ahead and uh, get a good vantage point of what's going on here. Oh, boy. Okay. So let's head north, grab that one hollow tape that's kind of off by itself, then we can go into the main building area. Sounds like a plan to me. Oh, here was the firehouse. I was in the wrong place. But I mean, it all worked out, I guess. I get from this side, I can. Oh, 
Too close. Back up. Your breath smells. There's all these high levels are giving me some good uh, experience and stuff, I guess. Yeah, but hold on. We gotta get away from that tick. I don't want it to suck my lifeblood away. Here we go. Oh, fuck. Scorpion found his way back here, huh? How am I hitting the fucking scorpion? Excuse me? The fuck? Oh, hey guys. The fuck? Now the scorpion's gone. Great. That's that's fine. This is fine. Yoink. There we go. Okay, let's uh let's that data hole. Out of that, that, that. Hello, kid. Said uh Springfield feedback. Mr. Ainsley. I wanted to remark upon the fascinating oh. design of your new Spring Hill golf course. You appear to have seven holes. It's fucking terrifying. Yeah. Shit, I fell. You will be that during the three mile drive from the fifth hole to the sixth. And then seven. Ah, uh -huh. seven. God damn. I confess, when I heard you had carved up your championship golf course for housing tracks, I was concerned it might have impacted the quality a little. Clearly, I underestimated the scope of your ambition. Quarterly yours, Henrietta Winchester. That was the most snobbiest fucking thing I think I've ever heard. Probably in my life. Um, I guess we gotta go defend our landfill right now. Because I'd rather not lose it, you know. But, uh... So much late action in this fucking episode, y'all. Not that one. Um... I guess what we'll do... Uh, we'll go to the landfill, defend it, then we'll go back to the uh, um, House of Mystery. We'll fabricate that phantom device from the hallucinogen and the stealth boy, just so I don't forget about them and end up, uh, you know, SOL. You know, but uh, all right, we got eleven seconds to get my ass up here, so. Fighting mole rats. Come on, you snarly motherfucker, let's go. Right, I need that. I can't get rid of it. Cool. Even better. 
Don't need those five millimeters. Don't need the ten millimeter. Don't need those. Why do I have missiles? God damn it. Excuse me, I'm doing something here. Sir, excuse me, sir. I'm doing something here. God. I can't repair any of my stuff. Still out of ballistic fiber. Son of a bitch. I can repair that piece. Why does it all require ballistic fiber, though? I don't understand that. Is it because it's strengthened or something? Oh, I can make the Garbage Mysteries now. That's cool. Hold on, does the Trapper stuff require... to repair? No, it does not, so I can... Arm, right arm. Let's see. Yeah, because that takes fucking ballistic stuff too, apparently. Just fucking drop out of the goddamn ground. The only thing I care about is my left leg here and my chest piece, which gives me more endurance, which it's broken anyway, so alright. Okay. Let's see. I can use that at level 40. I'm getting up there pretty quick. I'm going to save that. Because that's the first and only one I've seen, so I want to keep it. Um, let's see. Go ahead and get rid of that. Get rid of the strengthened right arm. Okay. Cool. And then back in the workbench here. To store all that. Let's go ahead and store the uh, that one. What's my... um? Mole miner thing do? 53? Ooh. Also, I just want this because it looks fucking badass. So. It's also a lot less heavy than that damn thing, so. I'm gonna store that too. Oh, right, I had this exterminator's pickaxe. Hmm. Let's go ahead and store this power armor. Since I'm out of course for it anyway. Pretty much. I'm getting to read the, listen to those. Uh, not that, damn it. Let's start listening. Welcome back, dear listeners. It's time once again to put aside all you think you know, all you believe to be true. Time to open your mind to the strange, bizarre, and sometimes terrifying world that exists in the shadows and fringes of our own, where myth, legend, and rumor are made real. Yes, it's time for more thrilling Tales from the West Virginia Hills. In tonight's thrilling story, Sideshow Snallygaster, the carnival has come to the Tyler County Fairgrounds. Billy Harding and his dad wander past the games and rides. Cotton candy in hand, peanut shells and popcorn crunching beneath their feet as a sideshow barker touts a frightful attraction. Hurry, hurry, hurry! Step 
swindle, Billy. All just smoke and mirrors. But he said it had six legs. <laughs> Trust me, son. When you get inside, all you'll see is a, a shaved bear with extra legs glued on. Aw, Dad, please, I'm begging you. Billy, Billy! Whoa, whoa, slow down there, champ. Sorry, Mr. Harding. Hi, Teddy. Were you just in there looking at the Snallygaster? My dad says it's a fake. I tried, but it cost five tickets. Five tickets? It's gotta be real if it costs that much. Yeah, that's what I thought, too. You know, it was a carny who coined the phrase, there's a sucker born every minute. Dad. Anyway, when I didn't have enough tickets, I tried sneaking in. You did not. Did so. Sorry, Mr. H. <laughs> it's okay, Teddy. Your secret's safe with me. Gee, thanks. So, I went around the back, looking for a place to sneak under the tent, and overheard two workers say the smelly gas to escape. Escaped? You're kidding! All right, all right. I, I, I hate to break it to you, boys, but that's just a publicity stunt to stir up intrigue. Those men were scared stiff. What should we do, Dad? Well, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going home. If you two want to stay longer, then so be it. But what about the Snally Gaster? <laughs> like I said, no such thing. Just don't dawdle too long, understand? They're closing soon. Okay, Dad. You think he's right about it being I don't know. Well, the only thing I have enough for is the fun house. Wanna go? Same here. Come on, it's this way. Something yeah. is loose at the carnival. But is it a menacing beast? Or just a cock and bull hoax? Tune in next time for the thrilling conclusion of I chose Snallygaster. And now time for the conclusion of Sideshow Snallygaster. Tonight, we bring you the final chapter of Sideshow Snallygaster. When last we left off, two boys, Billy and Teddy, were headed toward the fun house, trying to shake off the upsetting rumor that a dangerous beast escaped its cage. Shoot it, Kenny! That's the end. Um, apparently that mutation that, uh, you gain stuff from eating, uh, plants instead of meat? 
Apparently, I don't gain hunger if I eat meat. Huh. I guess it's time to make a bunch of corn stew and stuff, huh? Anyway, we'll go back in here real quick, like... Get some! Damn it. Listen here. God, this sword sucks. Okay, perfect. It's done now. Who wants to die? <laughs> Alright. Exit. Stage left. What? Right, I need my veil on. I was looking for it at the bottom because uh, it's been at the bottom before. Because it was a worn veil, now it's a veil of secrets. Okay. Phantom device. What's this phantom device thing? Also, drop that fucking thing, will you? God. Oh, I should probably need that on before I die in here. Phantom device freezes or frenzies nearby creatures and renders you almost completely invisible. Ah, oh, cool, I can sell it. That should push me over the edge to uh, level up, right? If it gives me experience, that is. Boo, it didn't. Anyway, we need to go to my camp real quick, I'm sorry. Wait, what enemies are nearby? Get the fuck out of here. I guess because they're scorched up above? Can't wait until I can get that marine combat armor. Oh, it's so good. It was my favorite thing in Fallout 4. And I know it's in the game because I have mods for it already. Because I bought them in preparation for when I get the armor. Hey! No! No living for you. Okay. Now we're gonna go home. So yeah, we'll, uh, I'm gonna collect some corn, some yuta fruit, and some taters, and then we're gonna make some food that we can carry with us to eat. We're, uh, big old fatty fat, and we need food, food, because I don't want to start with that. Scarecrow. Got him. I missed one there. Try to get all of it. Okay, perfect. Now we cook. All food. I guess we want to go plants. Yeah.
Beautiful juice. Mm. Just juice for those, huh? Increases max AP. Yeah, why not? Oh no, my boiled water's out. Oh no, whatever will I do? Okay, where's my eight at? So I got some muta fruits, so I'll go ahead and just drop that. Still have some potatoes. Yeah, so I got some potatoes, so go ahead and drop those. Alright, corn, where you at? There we go. Beautiful. Okay. Now. Now we go back up to the White Spring Resort. And finish what we started. Ugh. Oof. Can you believe like 30 minutes ago we were there? And it's been about 30 minutes, right? God, I love these places like this. They're fucking great. Just places off the beaten track where, you know, there's kind of a little random thing. Makes the game so cool. Okay. What's getting fired at over there? My god. I didn't repair my fucking shotgun. God damn it. Well, let's go inside. All right. So I've actually seen the interior of this when someone else was playing it, but I've never seen it myself. It's apparently just like a very ritzy hotel thing. Oh, we leveled up, by the way. Cool. Um, are we 29 now? We're not, are we? We are 20. Wait, 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 we're 29. What the fuck? Hold on. Was I lied to here? Where's my last fucking lock picking level? You bastards. Is it 49? Oh. God, if it's 49, just kill me fucking now, will ya? Mm. I wonder if I should get cannibals since I can't eat meat and have a restore now. Or I wonder if the mutation would override cannibal. Hmm. Oh, uh, never mind. I know what I'm getting. Hell yeah. Strength is 11 now. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Okay. Let's find those hollow tapes. We'll listen to them. And then I think there's some vendors that need my attention here, so. Everything changes. It's funny what comes to mind at a time like this. When I was little, I used to come here with my grandfather. Every morning, we'd sit right here, have donuts, read the paper. Just the two of us. Everything changes. They got rid of the donuts and the staff and the whole world. All clear. This the spot is secure. It's still here. Joyce did her best. They all did. They make it out there. As for me, I'm going to stay right here. Have one last donut. Whatever happens, happens. Everything changes. But in the end, can't imagine a place I'd rather be. A man who likes his donuts, I can respect that. Oh man. Oh, 
I also picked up another one. Uh, bridge card. Tynan. Another scotch. Oh, Tynan, we have the Winchester again. What about you, Liz? You made up your mind yet? Oh, Bill's keen on Charleston. We were social with the governor. I'm sure he'd make arrangements for us. Evans? That snake? He was always for sale. Not a terrible thing if you're the buyer. Can you imagine? Parading into town like a troop of beggars. And Charleston, no less. It always was a slum. Now, with refugees swarming like flies. Ugh. No. The resorts are the better option. If the White Spring won't have us, we should try Pleasant Valley. Even Sunny Top. Sunny Top? Really? I'm not there for the skiing. Or the clientele. But I'd rather stay at a shoddy lodge than take my chances with whatever may be going on down in the valley. Bam. Just set it down, set it down. Now, let's finish this rubber. Dollar a point. Fun. Uh, one last toast. All right, all right. Settle down. I know the last few weeks have been a shock. We all hoped we could stay here forever. But when you stop and think about it, we've been blessed. So many people have had it so much worse. For the past year, the White Spring has been our home. A shelter from the storm just outside the gate. It's time for us to face that storm. But we're ready. Ready like none of us was on that day. We've had time to plan, to prepare, to stock up, to find friends to share the road ahead. The White Spring bought us that time. Let's make the most of it. Ladies and gentlemen, one last toast. To the White Spring. Um, Joyce's message. Dave. Dave, honey, it's Joyce. I don't know if you'll ever get this. Welcome. But I wanted to make sure there was something here if you came looking. You made it. God. Start. It's uh, it's about two thirty in the morning, New Year's, twenty seventy nine. I've been here for the past year since the war. We me, exceptional. A couple of the staff, local, about a hundred guests, and the robots. <laughs> Never thought I'd be grateful for the robots. We made out all right. You made me manager. Can you believe it? But we have to go. Paul and I. We're leaving for Charleston in the morning. You and the girls. I miss you so much. Take care of them for me, alright? All my love. Always. People suddenly see value in gold and silver again. Fancy that. I wish they each had their own, like, inventory. Was that all the hollow tapes that I got so far? Um, yeah, they're coming. Oh, this one. Jack me. Recording. All right. What are we looking at? Hmm. I've got nothing. Really, Lou? Really? You set up the damn things. Don't tell me you don't know how to hack them. Can't you just shut them off? Or keep them from turning on us? There has to be a way. Paula. No. Really, no. I'm sorry, Paula. We've tried everything. Not just me. Every guest who can work a terminal. We have been locked out. We're getting kicked out, and there's nothing we can do. Paula, how's the training going? Friedrich's classes are a joke, but the gifts have been pitching in. The Warrens picked up a few things on safari. Sergeant Tomlinson's been teaching marksmanship. Tomlinson? That crack thinks the communists are bugging his room? Yeah. Best we got. God. At least people have been stocking up. The all-you-can-carry shopping spree was a hit. 
No one turned that down. A anyone have anything else? Robert, how are things? <sighs> Keeping on. Good. The gala's on Sunday. So, this may be our last staff meeting. Whatever happens, we did all we could this past year. I couldn't have done it without you. Thank you. Don't mind me, I'm just selling stuff. What are the last hollow tapes? Are they outside then? Oh, no. I think I got them all? Yeah. Did you give me any experience or anything for that? Chicken thigh! What about you? Do you sell Welcome anything? To you sell recipes. Which would tell you what you owned and you knew how to make. It would be great, but unfortunately... It does not. Murder looking black powder. Today. Security status is red. Please. Please back at Appalachia. You just sell toys? What can the captain get? Yeah, just toys, okay. We and you sell outfits, right? Of suits yeah. For every taste and engagement. This you modern saw. combat armor hardly seems sporty. Oh, combat armor. Okay. Heavy metal chests. This guy sells actual important armor. Okay. Nothing I want, though. The local game has been rather more spirited since the war. Live Sheik. Okay, what do you sell? This, this is Nothing. Live Sheik. Gotcha. The new stand. What do you sell? Nothing. Okay. Chemist. New patient detected. Just a drug seller. Okay. We have Is that everything? Please remember to secure. There's a concierge over there. Security's here. Security patrol status. Okay. Well, I think that's everything for the White Spring then, everyone. Yeah, let me just double check the uh, quests here. That's not related, that's not related, that's not related, that's not related. Yeah, I think we're all pretty much done here. Um, ah, let's go to the service entrance, I guess, real quick. Um, what is the best way to get out of here, would you say? Probably that door? It might be, I don't know. We'll see. So yeah, just a ton of different bots down there you can sell to and all that. And from what I've read online, um, all the vendors, they have, uh, they're, they're, they have factions, basically. There's uh, the responder robots and there's the white spring robots here and they all share caps. So the responders have 200 caps per day that they can barter with. And the uh, white springs have 200 caps that they can barter with per day. So... I think there's also like some other robots. I've, I think I saw Enclave somewhere, but I don't know where the fuck that's at. That's kind of weird. So okay, let's uh, take a look here. Let me go sell. Do I mean just jumping up top here? Never mind. Fuck. I think I was a little bit higher than this around here. Maybe uh, 
Maybe one of these light posts can get me up there. No? Okay. Well, I'm sad now. I guess I'll just, uh, climb up here like a common hoodlum. <laughs> Sweet. Okay. There we go. There's the servicing entrance done, which I'm assuming is just this, right? Yeah. I don't think I found any key cards or anything in there, so I think we might have to look a little, look around a little more in there or something. Or uh, there's different uh, plays that will give me different stuff, and that'll eventually say, "Here's a key card for White Spring." So we can get into the uh, one bunker down there. Okay. Um. All right. So there's a little more stuff east. I guess we could. Actually, east is all this stuff here, which if we head east, it'll be into the divide. Um, so we've hit White Spring. White Spring was our buffer zone. We will uh, continue going up here and just looping around. I think we'll hit this up here and we'll get like just to this area. And uh, basically, our way in is we're we're gonna go here, go up around here, then come back up here and do all this stuff because this is a ski resort, I know. Then we can get up here and do the uh, tune into the top of the world station finally. So that's off my fucking map. But uh, yeah, I think that's the plan for next time, everyone. So until then, I'm going to go back home, repair my fucking shotgun and the rest of my guns for that matter, because they're all probably pretty bad. Um, but yeah, we'll uh, we'll see how stuff goes. Until then, everyone, I'll catch you later. Bye now.